We're live. The brands that make you feel like a kid. That's what we're talking about. That's a brand new one. That's from Darius Rucker. Fires don't start themselves on 101.1 KRMD. It is 910 now. I'm Mason in the morning, broadcasting live on the radio and on Facebook. You can go to facebook.com slash KRMD Mason. Go give me a like and follow along. See what's going on inside the studio. It's kind of fun. You can also go to YouTube at Mason in the morning. Easy to find. If you missed the keyword this hour for the Kane Brown ticket giveaway, it's your last chance. That's why we're calling it our last chance ticket giveaway. Tickets tickets are going to be used this Saturday. Doors open at 530 Brookshire Grocery Arena. If you missed the keyword, it was Bossier. B-O-S-S-I-E-R. If you're not sure how to spell Bossier. B-O-S-S-I-E-R. I hope you know how to spell it. Right now we're talking about brands. This is kind of cool. Um, if you ever go to Hastings, Nebraska, uh, you got to go check out the Kool-Aid Man. <laughs> there's a brand new six foot statue right there at the uh what do they call it the hastings museum the kool-aid man like the full size like when you were a kid and you saw the kool-aid man burst through the wall and have a kool-aid size kool-aid shaped <laughs> hole in the wall yeah it's that kool-aid man there's a full size statue you can take a picture there if you ever go through hastings nebraska some of the kids i went to high school with went to junior college there in Hastings, Nebraska. But yeah, they just put that up and uh, Kool-Aid ended up making this list of uh, the top brands that remind us of our childhood. I think it's an interesting list. And it definitely, it definitely has to do with your age though, right? And I think just glancing at this list, most people who took this survey must be around my age. I'm just guessing here. Uh, but whatever brand comes to mind, that makes you think that's my childhood. Put that in the comments. YouTube, Facebook, you can text it to me too, 320KRMD. And uh, we'll go through the top 10. According to this survey, these are the brands that make people feel most like a child. By the way, Kool-Aid is number seven. Number seven, which I think is cool. I love Kool-Aid too. When you're a kid, it's amazing. And then when you're a grown up, people try to talk you out of it. And they even use phrases like it's bad. My Kool-Aid's bad. You're, you're drinking the Kool-Aid, huh? Yes, I'm drinking the Kool-Aid. Kool-Aid is incredible. Have you had it? It's delicious. <laughs> Am I drinking the Kool-Aid? They always say it about stuff, you know, like, I don't know. I think someone said it not too long ago about the iPhone, because I always get the new iPhone when it comes out. Oh, you're drinking the Kool-Aid. Sure am. Kool-Aid's incredible. It's super delicious. My, my Kool-Aid is sugar-free at home? Huh. I love the Kool-Aid, and it reminds me of my childhood. <laughs> number seven, a drink of the Kool-Aid. But let's start from the beginning. Let's start from number 10, Hasbro. Hasbro. Now, I'm not even sure what all that entails, but I know Hasbro makes me feel a little bit like I'm a child again. <laughs> I think it's a lot of stuff, right? For me, it's not as much as this next one, though. This was absolutely my childhood. Nerf. Nerf. Huh? That's childhood isn't it? It was for me. I had everything Nerf. Nerf football, of course, I think was the first thing that I ever had. Nerf football. But I had like Nerf archery set and Nerf guns, you know, shooting the Nerf things. Nerf with the suction cups and stick to stuff. I'd shoot it right now at the screen, get stuck. Oh, Nerf. Childhood. Absolutely. Another brand that makes you feel like a kid, number eight is Mattel. Once again, it's a whole bunch of stuff. Mattel, right? So I think that's a pretty decent one. Mattel and Hasbro, I just know it's so many things. I feel like it, was be, it would be more specific for, for, for it to give me that same thing like, like Nerf does. But then at number seven, Kool-Aid. Absolutely. Kids drink Kool-Aid. So do I. Number uh, six is Disney, which to me, I don't know why this doesn't feel as much like childhood as these other ones. I mean, I obviously watched all the Disney stuff. I don't know if Disney's just changed in my mind as a grown-up. You know, and Disney owns everything now. Like they own all these news channels and they own Star Wars and they own Marvel comics. So Disney's weird for me. It doesn't make me think childhood anymore. I don't know why. I think there's something, something's happened in my lifetime to Disney that it doesn't feel like a kid thing anymore. I don't know. This does though. Number five, Monopoly. I played so much Monopoly when I was a kid. That was always the family game. I was a serious Monopoly player. I think I won every game we ever played. 
You can ask my family. Ask my sisters. <laughs> I, I, was, I took it seriously. I took Monopoly very seriously. Uh, but yes, uh, number four, this is great. Hot Wheels. Absolutely. That's childhood. Hot Wheels tracks, mini hot, hot Wheels. What is the micro machines, those kind of things? I don't, but Hot Wheels is what I call them. I don't even know what the brand names of all those other ones were besides micro machines. But were they Hot Wheels micro machines or were they something else? To me, they were Hot Wheels. And that's why I think that's a great brand. And it definitely makes me think about my childhood. Number three, Play-Doh. Yeah, for sure. A lot of Play-Doh. A lot of Play-Doh everywhere. I went to daycare too. Play-Doh. <laughs> All throughout everything. In the carpet. I remember we had like a Play-Doh room. And why did we have carpet in that room? It was like embedded in there. Childhood. You walk in with your shoes off. And it was like you could just feel like you're walking on Play-Doh. That was nuts. <laughs> that was nuts. Number two, this one's great. I think this is going to be so many generations. Lego. Did you Lego? Did you play with Legos? Yeah, everybody played with Legos. When did Legos get invented? Does anybody know? Put it in the comments. Legos, for sure. What does this say? I got a text message. When it comes to my childhood memories, I go to food. Would be macaroni and cheese with weenies and Ninja Turtles. <laughs> Yeah, the, the Ninja Turtles macaroni and cheese, is that what you're talking about? Because I remember that. Ninja Turtles mac and cheese, that was awesome. Everything Ninja Turtle was awesome when I was a child. I left my list, I lost it. There it is. Okay, and then the number one. This is the number one, according to this survey, the brand that brings people back to their childhood. The, the, the brand that makes them go, yes, I was a kid. I'm still a kid if you say that word right? Nintendo. Did that do it for you? <laughs> it absolutely did it for me. Nintendo was the greatest thing that was ever invented when I was a kid. There was more Nintendo than anything else. I remember the first time I saw one was like uh, my, one of my family friends that was rich. <laughs> you know, at least to me, he was rich. He had all the stuff and he had the first Nintendo and he brought it over to my house so we could play it. And we sat in front of it until like our fingers got b big blisters and not joking, like big old huge blisters and he'd pop them and they would, they would hurt too much. And then you'd have to tape them up just so you could keep playing Nintendo. Nintendo was everything when I was a kid. I love it. And it still makes me think about it. I want to get one now. Now I wish I had my original Nintendo, the NES. I remember as a kid having the box and then setting the small TV on top of it and just playing for hours with, with the controller that was hooked up. Oh, childhood was awesome. So those are the top 10. Hasbro, Nerf, Mattel, Kool-Aid, Disney, Monopoly, Hot Wheels, Play-Doh, Lego, and Nintendo. Those were the top 10 brands that make you feel like a kid again. And I think it's a great list. If they missed some though, and I'm sure they did, there's probably some real obvious ones that they missed. Like... Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles or something else like that. Uh, put it in there. Let me know your age too. You don't have to, you know, feel too bad about it. It's just for fun. So if you happen to be, you know, 96 and you remember your favorite brands from a kid, that's fine. You're still very young at heart. <laughs> Nintendo. That was me. Absolutely. Nintendo. All the time. I wish I had one now. Hot Wheels, Kool-Aid, drink the Kool-Aid. Whoever decided that was a bad thing, they don't know what they're talking about. Drink the Kool-Aid. It's fine. It's delicious, actually. 